I am going to be showing you guys what is in my purse. Hi everybody, it's Misha. Welcome back to my channel, or welcome if you're new. If this is your first time ever seeing me, hi, thank you for clicking on my video. I try to upload two videos a week, and I would love to have you, so make sure you subscribe and turn on my post notifications so you never miss an upload. For today's video, I am going to be showing you guys what is in my purse. I know these videos are super old and I don't even know if people post these anymore. I've been wanting to do this video since I started YouTube. I don't know if it's because like this is what I used to watch on YouTube. I am super nosy. <laughs> I don't know if anybody else is like this. I'm going to expose myself. But like when I see a girl with a purse, I mean... I just want to go through it, okay? Honestly, I wish these videos were still a thing on YouTube. They might be, but like people I'm subscribed to don't post these. We just need to bring it back, basically, is what I'm saying. I just thought it'd be fun to bring it back for a day and show you guys what's in my purse because there's probably other people out there who are nosy like me and want to know what's in my purse. So I actually just started carrying a purse probably like a year ago is when I, yeah, actually literally like right around this time is when I got my first purse. But I used to carry these like mini backpacks I would literally go in Walmart like once a month and get a new black mini backpack because they were so cheap they would fall apart but that's just what I liked and I don't know why now I own two purses so this is my purse she's so cute i will link it in the description box if you want to check it out this is what it looks like though it's so cute i love it oh i didn't even tell you guys why i would always wear mini backpacks i would refuse to buy a purse because i felt like a mom like what's wrong with that <laughs> even my boyfriend would be like why don't you get a purse instead of this little backpack and i would tell him i feel like a mom with a purse Maybe one day I'll be that mom wearing the big purse with all the stuff inside of it. But for now, we're gonna stick with her because she's perfect and I love her. So basically, I'm just gonna go through, show you what I have in here, and that's gonna be the video. So if you wanna see what I carry in my purse, just keep on watching. We'll start here on the side. I have these little like, I don't know what they're called. I got them from Hobby Lobby, and I just clip them to the side of my purse to make it a little cuter. Okay, my phone is getting on my nerves, but I always keep it back here. That's the only thing back here. But this is just my phone. If you guys want me to do an updated what's on my iPhone, I will do that, just let me know. And I also have these glasses hanging on here at all times because I always put these on when I feel ugly and they just save the day. I got these in a set on Amazon and if I remember I will link those in the description box as well. I actually want to kind of make like a storefront or something so that I can start linking stuff all in one place that I show in my videos because I love when other people do that. So here is what the front of my bag looks like. There's a zipper here and then a pocket. The big zipper and then a little pocket in the back. So we will start with what I have in the front zipper. So that's what it looks like in there. I think we all know by now I'm a chapstick fiend. Look, it's bad. So first I have three chapsticks. This one is a cake batter. Then I have two fun dip ones. This one is blue raz and this one is grape. I cannot go anywhere unless I have a million chapsticks on me. I could easily pick one of these and put them in there and be perfectly fine. But like in my head, I'm like, what if I want to taste blue raspberry? But what if I want to taste like... And then I have a car mix. Next, I have a whole bunch of Q-tips. I like to use these like whenever my makeup smudges or like my eyes water super bad. So I can just like clean up the area where my makeup got messed up with these. Then I have some Abriva. This is like for cold sores on your lips. I don't know if anybody's noticed in my videos, but I have a bump on my lip right here. I got it last summer. I was in the pool all day, every day. This bump appeared and it hasn't gone away. I tried to use Abriva. It didn't work, so... We're just kind of hoping one day she'll disappear. Then lastly, I just have the little Michael Kors book thing that it came with. I just never took it out. That is all I have in the little front pocket. In the little pouch behind the front pocket, literally all I have is this little thing of wax from my orthodontist. These are for my braces. When I first got them on, I had like a hard time adjusting to them. They would cut up my mouth a lot, especially in the back. So I constantly had to have wax on me. I just keep it in here in case like it starts that up again. Now for the main pocket of my purse. This is where the mess is as you can see there's a pocket on each side and then the center compartment is its own little thing i don't 
room. So I'm gonna show you guys what's in this side, this side, and then we'll go into the middle. First thing I have are these two mini mascaras. I just keep these in here in case I need to touch up my mascara or we're out and about and decide to go in somewhere. Mascara really saves the day. So I have this Too Faced one and this one by Chella. I think that's the brand. Next, I have a flashlight that my boyfriend gave me. He went in Harbor Freight and got a two pack and told me to put one in my purse. So I don't know why, but this little flashlight makes me feel so safe. Like, what is it gonna do? I don't know, but if I ever get stranded, at least I have a light and I can see my way back to Gage. Then I just have this mini mirror. I got this for Christmas. This is what it looks like. Just a little mirror. I use this to put on my mascara in my car. <laughs> Lastly, I just have my favorite lip liner, the Rimmel London Lip Liner in Cappuccino. I have it on right now. If you want to go try it, you should. I love this thing. It's been with me for like six months and it looks like crap. Yeah. I have the lady products. You knew this was coming. We have a painting liner and then two pads. So, awkward part is over. Next, I have a pepper spray. And I will use it. This is just to keep all the weirdos away from me. I've actually never had to use this. Hopefully, I never do. Yeah, she stays on me and I can flicker pretty fast and start squeezing. Then I have a pin. I don't know why, but I feel like you always need a pin whenever you don't have a pin. And then I just have an extra dose of my morning and night meds. Just in case I end up staying the night somewhere or we end up staying out later than we thought. I always have these on me and I can take them so I don't now we're gonna go into the middle little area. First thing I have is this little baby lotion. I just think this is the cutest thing ever and I actually use it a lot. Yeah, it's just like a little hand cream. If you got some dry hands or some dry knees or elbows or all the things, just put this on and smell like a little baby. I swear, the smell of this makes me excited to have children one day. I can just imagine giving it a little warm bath and putting it to bed and it's smelling like this. Oh my gosh, this has to be my favorite thing ever. It's so good. To go with my lotion, I also have a perfume. I've told you guys about this before in one of my first videos. It's actually almost gone, but I do have another one. This is the Clinique My Happy Perfume, and this one's the Cocoa and Cashmere scent. This one smells really good. It actually used to be like one of my favorite scents. I'm definitely like getting over it, but it still smells amazing. I love the whole line of the My Happy Perfumes. They smell so good, and they last all day long. Then I just have my wallet. I think this came from Target. This wallet actually came with like a little lanyard that I could put on there. And if I ever go anywhere and I don't want to take my purse, I can just take my wallet and put this on it so I don't lose it. Yeah, this is my wallet. Super cute, super simple. This is the pattern of it. I think it's super cute. Next, I just have a scrunchie just in case I ever need to put my hair up or use it for anything. I just think it's nice to always keep a scrunchie or a ponytail in your bag. It's a cute little polka dot pattern. And last two things I have are some gum. I feel like everybody has gum in their bag. You just never know. Um, this one is the Orbit Peppermint one. Look at this pack how weird it is and then i just got this yesterday this used to be my favorite gum as a kid this one's just the bubble yum cotton candy flavor okay guys that is everything i have in my little bag i hope you guys enjoyed watching this video leave me a comment telling me what an essential item that you keep in your bag is i love you guys so much and i will see you in my next video bye